I, what do I say? <laughs> oh. Hi, welcome to our channel. This is Family Adventures. I'm Gwen. I'm Lauren. <laughs> and today we have pin mail. Yes. From Facebook. Yeah, um, yeah. mine are from eBay and eBay. Um, Mondo Tees. What's wrong with eBay? I don't know. So just a random pin hole. hole. Yeah. You want to start? Okay. So this is from Jenny's, which is Discount Disney Pin Trading. She does uh Friday. Well, I don't know. She's it used all to be Sunday. Now no, it's... it used to be Saturday night. Oh yeah, Saturday night. Once a month. Mm -hmm. Sometimes she does boards. Now. Whenever. Last week she did Sunday. This week she did Thursday. Yeah. Okay. So. I didn't get anything because I my comments kept getting eaten. There was 300 people Yeah, it was, it's crazy So I, I stopped watching. I obviously buy too many pins anyway. Yeah. So I got this Minnie Mouse. It's just your red jeweled. Because I didn't have that one. And she has good deals too. Except right now with everything going on. Um, Oops. things are a little more costly than before. So that one's cute. <clears throat> yeah. Because I'm starting to get to a point where my mini, I'm not... You don't like mini anymore? No, I'm, I like mini, but it's... You're done collecting it? It's just, you don't see too much of... Different styles. Yeah. The one, the ballerina, first I wasn't into that, but then I did try to get that. On Thursday night on Jenny's, and I didn't get it. I like that mini Tinkerbell I saw I sent you, but you said it was too much. Yeah, because I don't go crazy on prices. Um, and just this, uh... That's cute. Bow. Fourth of July. Fourth of July, yeah. Sorry, I'm getting texts here. Yeah, you text. should probably... You did? Yeah. And then... I won... She does one game, and it's... It, when she, her husband comes out dressed as a pug, you have to, um, sorry, let me do that now. Um, you have to comment. You'll hear him come in, and when you hear him come in, you have to comment. It's tough to be a pug. And she picks a certain amount of, pe you know, mm -hmm. comments. And I always try. I don't know if I ever won before. Maybe one other time. I think I did. Yeah. But, um, I got paper clips. They oh, just stitch. Stitch and, yeah. Angel. Angel. Yeah, that was cute. So that's it. That's all I got. Alright, so to stick with stick, Stitch and Angel, um, I ordered off eBay. I got a lounge fly. I think it still even might be available on loungefly.com, but don't quote me on that because I'm not sure. But I had to pick this up. Let me take it out of the plastic. This retailed for $25, and that's what I paid for on eBay. Um, free shipping. But I I picked this up. <laughs> I think it's really cute, and I probably will leave it on the backer card because of all the fish. Um, me and Richie had just binge-watched um, Lilo and Stitch, Lilo and Stitch 2, Stitch the Movies. Leroy and Stitch, like all those, then the series we started watching. So, <laughs> needless to say, I found this very cute and had to pick it up. <laughs> she feeds her fish a peanut butter sandwich. I don't know, I just like the whole scene of that. The backer card. So I got that. And then... I ordered online from Mondo Pins. Um, I heard about this place first from Ryan on Disney Pin Blogs. Is that right? Something like that. Disney Pin mm -hmm. Blog? Yes. Um, <clears throat> and of course, mine's not sponsored or sent to me, but I did purchase these. Um, I picked up a few. These all retailed for $10 a piece, and I've seen sellers probably triple that price. Um, also, they go on eBay for a lot more or secondary apps, but buying them directly from Mondo 
that or their website you get them for the retail of ten dollars so i got the up house they're a lot smaller than i thought they were going to be um for instance oh wow uh, this is a normal backer card you know like so that's cute though yes i like them so we have the up house and even their backer cards are nice and then sticking with up i also picked up this one of paradise falls because i really like that um scene there i'll do close-ups on all where are these from mondo um oh on ebay yeah, no mondo tees it's a website and then i picked up i kind of want to do a second order Oops. i picked up bras are they reasonable yeah ten dollars you were listening <laughs> i was too busy i was jumping on them live sale yeah live sale fanatic over here well don't you want that no i already have the other one then i picked up this is my favorite from alice in wonderland the flowers that they're little faces i love this this is probably like my favorite part of that movie it's not one of my top movies um well, I didn't have an Alice collection until this <laughs> uh, Yeah, so I got the flowers. And then I picked up this from my Lion King collection, which is growing crazily. Crazily? I yeah. don't know if that's a word. <laughs> <sighs> it's growing really fast. Um, I really like this pin. What is it, the night scum? Yeah, with Simba and Mufasa on Pride Rock. And then for Mike, because he has the Sword in the Stone collection. I thought he was Jessica Rabbit. He's Dumbo, <laughs> Jessica, uh, Roger Rabbit, um, and Sword in the Stone. And I feel like something else, too. There was a Dumbo pin I was looking at last time. <clears throat> and I think these are really cool. And I really like the backer card. So we have Madame Pardon. Min and Merlin. Just turn it up over there. Out there and see what the section is. Then Merlin. I haven't muted right now. And Merlin has the rabbit. Are you showing me because of the Star Wars things? Yeah, but I was going to say, go up there and where's the hat turn it on. And I have yeah, it she's right too now. busy with live sales. She can't focus on filming a video. Thanks. All right. So here's a close up of all the pins. And they were pretty fast on shipping. It maybe took about. A week, if that, to get to me. And I, I like these. Like I said, I want to order more. The back just has Mondo, their logo. Disney. Pin Source China. Now, they all say Disney. Like, I don't know if they're... Can you trade these in the parks? I don't know. But I... I'm not buying these to trade them. I'm buying these to keep in my collection. But yeah, I really like these. So that wraps up my my haul. Oh really? Yeah. Okay, so I have eBay. I'm kind of a little disappointed that um came in the packer thing here and it wasn't wrapped in anything it was just like this in the bag it's 
a tiki. I ordered a pin Sound from... Sound of the season. And it's supposed to, according to their... Um, what's, what's the word I'm looking for? Description. Uh, it was an artist proof and it was supposed to be rare. Well, my understanding of an artist proof is it has to say AP on the back. Mm -hmm. Now I just took my glasses off because that was bugging me with these ears. But I do not see any AP on there. It is a limited edition though, right? Yeah, sometimes they say it's really small. Not it stamped on there. No, I don't see an AP anywhere. So it kind of is a little upsetting. And like I said, it just was in this bag. It, mailer. It wasn't in any bubble wrap. Someone was selling that. Yeah, I did see it, but Some, I think yeah. I had already ordered it. That's and I had seen this then that said that it was artist proof, so... Because I think I screenshot I was it. like, and it was a decent price, so I was like, yeah, let me jump on that. So I think I got scammed. So, that was that. And then my next pin is a fantasy pin. And I actually got it from Brendan for Mother's Day. And it's um, Tahiti, um, what's that? I thought it said girls. Gals. Gals. Um, it's a doll whip with a Mickey head behind it. I like that one. With a hibiscus. What's that? Did you know about this? No. So it's he on picked... Instagram. That's the one I showed you, remember? Yeah. I like that one. Um, what, what? Oh, it's a TV torch. <laughs> I was, I took my glasses off. I can't see now. <laughs> and it doesn't say anything on the back. So. All right. What's the next one? And the next one I got from you. <laughs> and it's my first fig pin. Yes. Which I never heard of before. Yeah, I... Thanks so, to Ryan on Disney Pin Blog. Mondo teas I ordered from in a pink pin. That I found these. I got myself Ariel and Jackson. I just like the whole concept of it. Like it's a very detailed pin. I don't know. It's own. It was um. They retail for fifteen dollars. And they're quite large. Yeah, they're large. Be and, my biggest Cinderella pin. Yeah, and the pin back actually works as a stand. stand. So that's nice. Yeah, it's very. A very pretty Cinderella. Do you want to show how to? That's what I was looking at. But <laughs> so here's the pin bag. So it has a. It has a three pin. Post. post? Yeah. <laughs> so then the little backing slides on, and then it's actually since it has that thing it. I don't know if this is going to work. You can even see that. But it can stand up on its own. Which I like that. But then it also comes with a, the case it comes in. It can, you can also use you that as, as a stand. Yeah. There's other Disney ones. But they have like Toy Story I think. And Mickey and Minnie. There's a couple different versions of Mickey and Minnie. And they're different. Um, outfits. Well, this is one of their smaller ones, isn't it? That's the regular size. There's a regular size, a mini size, and an extra large. Okay. So I think that's... That wraps it up. That wraps it up. 
Well, thanks for watching, and let us know if you have ever shopped at Mondo Pins or Fig Pins and what you have in your collection. And we'll see you in the next video.